let's look at example 22 at a playground three boys and six girls are to be seated round a carousel with nine seats as illustrated the diagram here assuming that each child occupies exactly one seat in how many ways can this be done if the three boys must sit together so if the three boys must sit together then we have to make sure that no matter how we move them around three of them must be side by side so in other words why not we group them together as one single group all right so in total now we have uh, seven units g1 to g6 and a group of boys therefore a total number of ways to permit it this uh, seven units will be seven minus one factorial giving us 720 and number of ways to permit it these three boys because i still can move them around within that group there will be three factorial therefore the total number of ways will be 720 multiplied by six giving us 4320 right let's look at part b what is the number of ways if two particular girls cannot sit together so suppose that we look at uh, two particular girls uh, g3 and g4 so if these two girls cannot sit together it means to say that if let's say i fix the position of g4 then g3 cannot be in this position neither can she be in this position therefore i need to place my g3 right here 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 or here so it seems very difficult to work out this way because i have many cases to talk about all right so to solve this problem we can actually use the complementary method which will ease our calculations so to solve this problem we can actually use the total number of ways without any restrictions minus away the total number of ways for the two girls to sit next to each other this will give us the required solution so the number of ways without restrictions will be 9 minus 1 factorial because we have 9 seats and being seated in the circular uh, manner we will have uh, 8 factorial and how about the number of ways for the two girls to sit together so it's similar to what you saw in uh, part a All right so in this case we'll place the two girls together treating them as one unit so in total we actually have eight units to talk about All right therefore we have uh, eight minus one factorial permutating all the eight units but within this green box here i can still permit the two girls which is two factorial therefore the total number of ways will be the number of ways without restriction minus away the number of ways for the two girls to sit together giving us this as the answer all right there's an alternative method to solve uh, this problem all right the method is this i'm going to bring out g3 and g4 supposing that they are the two girls that i can't place them together so first we permitted the three boys and four girls giving us a seven minus one factorial which is six factorial and now the idea is to separate g3 and g4 in other words i can place the two of them at this position whereby we have the arrow there so as long as i place them in any of the two positions marked by the arrow then i'm going to separate them right that's the main idea so the number of ways to insert these two particular goals would be seven choose two seven positions marked by the arrows i choose two of them so once i slot them into the position i can still permutate them around because they need not take the fixed position that i place them hence the two factorial all right so finally i'm going to take 720 multiplied by 42 giving us this as the answer as well